Welcome. Three rooms, please. But before that, can we get something to eat? Oh, my apologies, but our cook isn't in yet. Hey, is she okay? Can we at least use your kitchen? Yes, please. Help yourself. Your friend looks like she's about to pass out. My stomach, it really is growling. <laughs> and here I thought that was just a silly human expression. Not bad. Not bad. It's good. I quite enjoy ingesting calories with you. Humans should learn to cherish these simple pleasures. This might be her first time sleeping, too. And apparently she never ate before today, either. Who in the world is she? She claims she's Maxwell. That Maxwell? Yeah. She's apparently a spirit in physical form. Well, not just any spirit. The Lord of Spirits. Wielder of the Four Elements. The Eldest Spirit. Maxwell has many names. And now we add Mila to that list? She's supposed to be the spirit Maxwell? You gotta be kidding me. Is Maxwell really that mighty? Of course. That's why this is so hard to swallow. I grew up hearing bedtime stories about Maxwell. What in the world would a spirit like that be trying to destroy? Trying to destroy? What are you referring to? She called it a Spyrex, I think. The device from the laboratory. Hmm. Maybe I should just ask Mila about it. I don't know. You have a nasty habit of poking your nose where it doesn't belong. Your cursed curiosity made me a wanted man too, you know. <sighs> well, think hard before asking, okay? Yeah, you're right. Good morning. Good day, Jude. I was just about to share my plans with Alvin. What is it? I'm thinking of returning to Nia Kara. Is that your hometown? More accurately, it's where my shrine is. If I go back, I might be able to re-summon the four. So, she really is Maxwell. This is where you come in, Jude. Will you accompany me to Nia Kara? What? It's true that you brought your current situation upon yourself, but I bear some of the blame as well. I'll put in a good word for you with the people of Nia Kara. I'm sure they'll look after you. Wow, you've put a lot of thought into this. Yes. Remember when you told me I seemed unconcerned? I decided to take that to heart. Mila, you don't need to practice your swordplay anymore? No need to concern yourself with my martial abilities. Well, if nothing else, you know how to swing the pointy end. Okay, I'll come with you. Good. You needn't worry. A little more practice wouldn't hurt, though. You think so? Better safe than sorry. Come find me once you're ready to go. Wait, you're coming with us, Alvin? Why not? I've come this far. Hey, Mila? Hmm? Thanks. <laughs> 